And we are back with Dinkum. Collect our traps. Now, it's been a few days since I've played, so I kind of forgot what I was doing. I think last time I went to the mines. Yeah, I have all this ore that I need to smelt. Oh, finally, we can harvest our uh, worm farm here to get some fertilizer. That's nice. And our quarry is digging up ore. That's pretty cool. So do we get like one ore every day or something? That's kind of nice. Our Kwandongs are ready. What else is ready? Honey. All right. I'm stocking up all this fertilizer. I should probably use it. I don't really feel the need to right now. But, um, I'm making it. I mean, why not use it? And yes, our pumpkins are still growing in the winter, which is great. What are you? Oh, Fiddler Beetle. Okay. Now, I do think um, the furniture salesman, Marvin, something like that, uh, he wants to move in. So we're going to see if we can make that happen. After we get this done. Alright. Let's feed. Our animals. Keep him happy. All right. Uh, first thing, we have a new visitor. Let's go see what they're all about. Shelia. Oh, are you like a, a chef? Tucker Box Special, currently paying top dink for flour. Cooking table. Green beans. Hi, Shelia. Good day there, Possum. The name's Shelia. Fletch got into contact with me and told me to come check out Flatopia. When she told me about all the tucker you can find here, I had to pack my bags and come take a look. I don't know what tucker is, but I'm going to assume it's a positive thing. We want tucker. I bloody love cooking and eating great food. 
I hope to try all the wonderful food you can cook here on Vladtopia. I love to meet you, Darl. Darl? Is that like deer? Where you're from? Tucker box. Uh, let's chat. Let's talk. Nothing beats a true blue sunrise, I reckon. Best time of the day, the morning. Everybody's so fast asleep and you can go about your business without anybody bothering you. I 100% agree with you. Um, I want to sell. What do you... What do you buy? You're paying top dink for flour. Okay, but you won't just buy anything. Maybe just food items? Hold on, I gotta try this. How much does John give me for flour? One thousand one hundred thirty-four. Some great produce there, Big Vlad. Two thousand eight hundred. That's more than double. That's pretty good. Sell it. But I don't want to get rid of my flour, so I won't sell anymore. How much does prime meat cost? Eat from an alpha will be four thousand. Um, no thank you, but I feel like I'm going to have to buy it to get you to move in. Uh, let's chat. Got a job for me? I've got a real hankering for a Pavlova. Think you can get me one? I can do that. I've got Pavlova. Three thousand nine hundred. Nice. Okay, now in order to get my furniture salesman in here, Marvin, Mervin, Marlin, whatever his name is, I'm gonna have to move the gazebo. Uh, let's talk about the town. I want to move a building. Move the greenhouse. No, not the greenhouse. Bandstand. You call it bandstand, I call it a gazebo. Let's move it. Alright, now we gotta pay off our debt. Because moving a house is expensive. Now... Let's find our There's another beetle. Um Oh our wheelbarrow. Where did I put it? Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, while I'm here, I'm going to need to buy some bead. Mine. Hey, Erwin. I want to chat. Got a job for me? I've been I feel like I've been wearing the same clothes for too long. Think you can find me some new clothing? No problem. Let's check our dumpster. Hey, there's a new beetle. I think those are worth quite a bit. Well, looky what we got here. Alright, Steve. Look what I found in the dumpster. I mean, my... My closet. Wackadoo. Big Vlad pulls through again. Thanks again. Take this as a reward. 
Oh my god. Well, that's great. I mean, I want a fountain. But, um, I think I need sprinklers to build it. Where is fountain? Brick fountain. Yeah, I need a sprinkler. I think I have to get my uh, farmer level up or something. I don't know how to get that. We'll find out someday. Uh, gazebo. Oh, um... Wheelbarrow. Okay, I'm going to put the gazebo kind of back here. A bit out of the way. Let's see, we're gonna have this road continue. That'll be good. I think that's far enough away. I might regret it later as we get more shops I need to set up, but. Let's go sell this stuff to John. I got a few things to sell. Take it. It's all yours. 8,000? Not bad. I'll take it. Alright, so that gazebo is moving over there. Now let's take all this dirt. And we'll do a little bit of landscaping here. Just even this out a little bit. So we can fit one more shop. Oh, whoops. You know, I should visit Franklin, too, before he closes. Sometimes he has good uh, blueprints. Maybe he has a sprinkler blueprint. What's up? A wooden lamppost? Uh, yes. 5,000. They're a little expensive, but uh, I've got money. What do you got here? Crafting table. Yeah, I should come in every day to check his blueprints. Uh, I want to chat. What's new? Do you think the whole world was like South City before everything went south? Can you even imagine how magnificent a world like that would have been? Um... I want to chat. Need anything? I want to get those hearts up. You have a logging license, right? Can you help me out and rustle up three mango sticks? No problem. Three mango sticks coming right up.
Here we go. Got your sticks. You've done a very adequate job. I'll give you this in exchange. A trench coat. I don't want to look like a creeper. Well, I'll give that to someone next time they ask for a change of clothes. Don't I already have a trench coat? I had one at one point. Let's keep working on these bars here. Getting them smelted. All right, back to landscaping. Having the dirt um, creator and leveling tool together would make this um, go quicker, but that's all right. It's not a lot of effort. If we need to do some heavy duty landscaping, we'll put that off until, uh, until we get the right tools, the dirt creator specifically. All we need to do here is just level this up out enough to where we can continue. I don't know. Can't speak. To where we can continue our road. And get our shop done. Built up here. Almost there. Plenty of extra dirt here. Hi, Fletch. Wonder if I put uh, park benches and things, they'll sit down. They just kind of wander around aimlessly. Be nice if I could designate like a a meeting area or you know, gather some kind of gathering area. Hi, Fletch. I'll talk to her. See, so you started making a dent in those milestones. Don't worry, Big Light. I got plenty more permit points to hand out. Oh, I know. Speaking of permit points, we're going to have to work on our dailies here in a moment. There we go. That's looking pretty good. Alright, now to get it to looking great, we're going to have to 
fill this in a bit. It looks weird having that large uh, drop off there. There. Hi, Clover. Oh, sorry, I skipped your dialogue. Let's chat. If you wear the same colors as somebody... If you wear the same colors as somebody and you can really connect. It's like you start humming in the same universal tune, you know? That's why I try to wear black a lot. I want to try and hum my own tune sometimes. Um, yeah, I suppose that's true. I don't really like to wear black. I like dark colors, but... Well, not right now. I'm wearing a very noisy shirt here. But, um... I actually like this shirt. It's like, um... Not quite as noisy and... Crazy as a Hawaiian shirt. But it's got, uh... Got a little bit of noise on there. Flowers. Hi there. What's new? Oh, I love your holiday shirt. Well, thank you. I was just talking about it. Very stylish. Uh, okay. Let's do some trapping and get our daily done. So dig treasure. Yep. Yeah. Smash ore rocks. Um, we'll try that. Hey, come here. Too easy. Ah, can't get out. It's a heavy duty trap. Back here. Kidna. All right, now let's look around for ores, which are going to be difficult to find unless some new ones popped up, and treasures. Treasures, not so difficult. Got all these scorpions. I feel like not capturing them is a waste. They're worth like uh, over 2,000, I think. Alright, now the hard part. We gotta find some ore rocks in this wasteland of stone. Yeah. 
and Quartz Crystal doesn't count, sadly. Oh, you're a big fish. What kind of fish are you? Ah, catfish. Okay. Suppose we could get more mangrove sticks. Work on leveling up our chopping skill. Those turkeys make weird noises. Wonder if I can capture a shark in a cage. That'd be something. I gotta try that. I only seem to sh uh, see sharks out at night. Are sharks, um, I guess they do mostly feed at night. I don't know if they're like considered nocturnal, but I think they do mostly feed at night. Not real sure on that one. Well, I am not finding ores. Oh boy. Bone. Grass seed. Yeah, I want that stuff. I don't want to throw away the battery or the phone. Alright, I guess I'll have to head back. Oh, more wire. Everyone's asleep, except for the turkeys, kidnas, and the ruse. I wonder if the ruse ever sleep. I don't ever see him sleep. And tomorrow, that gazebo should be moved. It should, it should only take one day to move. If you're moving it, it should take only one day to rebuild. So 
So that should be moved. And then we can start on the uh, furniture shop. Melvin? Marvin? His furniture shop. Hi. All right, let's put our treasure away. CDs, we can give that to Franklin. Put our seeds away. Not seeds, animal food. Man, we found a lot of ores to smelt. We're going to be smelting all of this throughout tomorrow as well. Did we complete our tasks? Yeah, this one's weird. I already did this, but I guess you can do it multiple times. There's just uh, an increased reward for capturing a croco for a limited time. And it's not like a one-time thing. It's, um, you get this extra reward. Uh, anytime you accomplish this task within... This uh, time frame, it was like three days or something. So I did it once, which is pretty sweet. What else do we got here? We want to practice smelting. Who are you, Erwin? Collect one tin, tin sheet. Bring one tin sheet. I want to trade. Oh, eh. I'll do the tin sheet. Where's tin sheet? Erwin, where are you? Don't go home yet. I have something for you. You were thinking about me. I completed your request. Here you go. Thank you, Big Vlad. Take these three tin bar. I just like smelting them. I don't really need them. Awesome. Well, with those tin bars, I can get three more tin sheets, so I'm not losing anything. That's pretty sweet. Alright, well, we got 20 minutes until midnight. just get a few chores done while we wait we always need more planks I think we're ready to hit the sack. Uh, let's put our torch away. Don't need that. Machine manual, probably don't need to carry that around. Alright, I think we're good. Uh, let's collect some permit points. Milestones, really cool. Milestone for using a wheelbarrow, nice. Milestone for trapping animals. Very nice. Everything hunter. For hunting creatures. Alright, 3,500. We can get uh, a new permit next time. We'll see what, uh, what Fletch has got for us. Call it a day. Oh, farming. Please go up faster. Is there any way I can get that to go up faster? 
I guess just build a gigantic farm. Get it. Alright, well we have no visitor. Uh, it is the 6th of winter. And I think I'll spend a day off camera. Just doing some work off camera. I'll get started on Melvin's shop here, I think. I'll put it right about here with some uh, a little walkway in between. Hi, Clover. Alright, so one day off camera and then we'll return pretty soon. <laughs> 